Well, could we have seen the peak of the latest wave of COVID-19 cases in this part of the state? First News senior reporter Jerry Ricciuti says recent numbers here and across Ohio are showing some progress. Ohio's chief medical officer says the state is still seeing what he calls an Omicron tidal wave of COVID-19. In fact, Ohio is averaging a staggering 22,000 new COVID-19 cases every day. But after weeks of record-setting numbers, hospitalizations are finally showing progress. That drop has been the steepest in Northeast Ohio, where hospitalizations have fallen by as much as 24%. Although specific numbers are not available, I'm told Mercy Health is seeing between 25 and 30% of its patients being hospitalized with COVID, and that number is coming down. Our walking care centers are seeing less volume last week than they did the week before. So all indications are pointing to a downward trend that we're seeing both on the outpatient side and the inpatient side. But experts stress the epidemic is not over just yet. Across the state, hospitalizations remain higher now than they were in late 2020 at the height of the COVID pandemic. But we're still you know, very busy with COVID. It's not gone. It's still busier than it was for most of 2021. For now, experts continue stressing the need for testing as well as vaccinations to reduce the chances for more severe infections that could land patients in the hospital. Hopefully, and this is just a, a hope at this point, it turns into something that's more of a common cold type, even if it's still around. Jerry Ricciuti, WKBN 27 First News.